to wrap things up with one last story to bring you joy, hopefully. This is what I'm liking. Like I mentioned earlier, today kicks off Women's History Month. To celebrate, I want you to meet a 19-year-old from Belgium who just made history as the youngest woman to fly solo around the world. In fact, she broke two Guinness World Records on the journey. It took her five months traveling through 41 countries across 32,300 miles. Jeez. Let's say hi to Zara. Hi, Zara. Hi, Kelly. Oh, my God. You're, it's, this is a tremendous feat. So why did you want to do it? So I'd always thought flying around the world would just be the coolest thing, like the most amazing adventure. I'm really lucky, both my parents are pilots, so I grew up around aviation. But I always assumed that it'd be too dangerous, too complicated, too expensive. So I never really thought about it. And then I was finishing high school, and I think that's when I realized, with that attitude, I'm not going anywhere. So I said, I'm doing this 100%. So I planned my route, grabbed a pen and a world map, and kind of drew a line around the world where I wanted to go, and then spent ages looking for sponsorship, emailed 500 companies. They basically all said no. But then a Bulgarian man phoned me up one day, and he said, Zara, how are you doing? And I want to help you out. Oh, that's amazing. See, it hit home with somebody. That's really cool. So it was quite a journey, but you faced many setbacks, right? I did. So I left in August, and it was supposed to take three months, but it actually took five months. And it was pretty tough, but amazing. Flying over Iceland, I think, was the most incredible moment when I saw an active volcano from the plane. Then the hardest moment for me was probably flying over California. At the time, there were some pretty bad wildfires. And it got to a point where I was flying along and I could just smell the smoke in the cockpit and not see a single thing because it was just so heavy. And later on, the toughest moment was definitely Siberia for me. I was flying in minus 31 degrees Fahrenheit. I was super, super remote and just really intimidating because if the engine quits, suddenly I'm stuck hours away from rescue in a really cold climate. But it was incredible. The people were amazing. And I couldn't have asked for a better opportunity. That's awesome. What a, what a cool adventure that you went on. I mean, this would make an amazing movie, just saying. Um, thank you so much, Zara. Continued success in the aviation field. I'm liking your post right now. Um, that's not all, though. I want to tell you our season-long partner, Pilot Pen, makers of G2, the go-to pen of the Kelly Clarkson Show, want to honor ultimate overachievers like you. I, I can't imagine, actually, anybody better to give this money to. So they're going to write you a check for $1,000. How's that sound? <laughs> all right, all right. Thank you. Hey, if you ever... If you ever want to do another cool trip like that, hit me up. I'll help you out. That's so cool what you're doing. I just want to see the pictures from it. Thank you so much. Thank you. That's really good to be the person in the back. All right.